Hey, good morning. Uh, so we're out here today at Centre Park's Woburn Forest, as you can see. Uh, we're coming out for a few days to uh, give you guys an overview of the resort, what there is to do, what you can see, uh, places to shop, places to eat, and activities that you can get yourself on with. Uh, as you can see at the moment, it's Christmas. So we've got all the Christmas activities and we've got uh, some really cool Christmas decorations that are up. So it should be really, really awesome to see. Uh, maybe we'll spot Santa Claus, maybe we'll see some reindeer. Maybe they're out and about, we don't know. Um, but hopefully you'll enjoy having a look around. I'll give you guys a tour of the executive lodge that we're staying in as well. Uh, the way it works here, we do a few nights. We do uh, Monday through Friday or Friday through Monday. That's how it works. You pick those slots. Uh, they don't do any other bookings like that on the lodges. Um, so keep an eye out for the video. I'll put it down in the description of the executive lodge tour so you guys can see because it's always good to actually see a video of somewhere rather than just pictures on a website. But if you do enjoy the video, if you're out, give us a thumbs up. I do appreciate it. it really, really does help us out a lot. And it'd be great if you could hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to be notified when we post all new videos. Let's go. So even if you've <laughs> So here in the main plaza of Centre Parks, Woburn Forest now, this is the main central hub where you'll get all your meals, you'll have all your activity areas, bike parking everywhere here, as you're not allowed. Uh, any vehicles on site at all, motorized or other, um, apart from ECVs. Um, so you've got the venue, you've got park market, as it says there, cycle park, and the plaza. So, as I said, this is all your restaurants and shops. You have got a Starbucks here as well. Christmas, we've got a Christmas shop. And then you've got a number of activities in here, which we'll show you in just a second. You've got the sports cafe. This is your main restaurant here in the plaza, downstairs at least anyway. So you've got a main bar here as well. It is all table service. Being a sports bar, you've got screens absolutely everywhere uh, it's really cool massive massive place you can all pull up your tables uh, all pull up your seats sorry and get all your tables together so here in the plaza we've got uh, a whole bunch of activities you can do so you can play tennis uh, you've also got the gym and the spa area down here you've got a pottery painting studio a craft room, a sports zone, football pool, everything in here. We've got some restaurants at the top as well. We've got a Starbucks, and this is where the sports cafe is as well. We've also got a couple of rock climbing areas as well, which are all different kinds of designs. Let's give you an overview of the map here at the plaza. So we're on the ground level at the moment, so you You've got sports cafe, Starbucks, um, the indoor sports, things like that. Um, the hotel is on the first and second floor. Um, you've got a few restaurants on the third floor. And then on the fourth floor, you've got more hotel rooms, the spa, and then the spa suites up on the fifth floor. You've got a few squash courts as well. So you're really fully equipped here for anything that you want to do, including ping pong. We know the overview of the gym, it's the um, life fitness equipment in there. We've got a few treadmills, a couple of cross trainers, some bikes, uh, and then you've got the fixed weight machines as well. So fairly, uh, fairly comprehensive gym there. But not too much actual equipment available. So that there's nobody in there. So we're here now at the village square. Uh, this is where you've got the subtropical swimming paradise. Um, you've got a few shops in there as well. Um, we'll go in there and give you an overview of the pool.
So you've got the lazy river here. Uh, you've got some rapids over the back and you've got a few slides up there. Um, they do provide rings as well for you. Uh, but this is all indoors, it's all covered. Nice and warm. So it's actually middle of winter here at the moment and this is fully heated in here. All the pools are heated, all of the slides are heated. Uh, even when you go outside, that's fully heated as well. Um, you just gotta just go with it. So next up here, we've got the rapids. Uh, we'll take you guys around this quickly. give you an overview of the whole of the water park here. So you've got the wave pool just down there. That's the entrance to the rapids and that goes outside. Pretty cold in there at the moment. You've got um, Ventura Lagoon, I think that's cool. Maybe that's that one to the left. Um, you've got a couple of really cool kids areas and then over at the back you've got the Lazy River as well. on the other one. There we go. Ready? Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. hire cabanas here as well um, I don't know the exact price of them but it's cool that you can do that uh, and there is a Starbucks down here as well gives you somewhere to put all your stuff you've got fridges safes in there towels come with this as well TVs so coming back out into the village square again um, this is where you'll have a few restaurants um, so you've got Cafe Rouge which is a French inspired restaurant. Uh, you've got a few shops here as well. So you've got the storeroom, which will be all your little trinkets and things like that. You've got Just Kids, which is where you'll be able to get all your toys for the little ones, your Lego, your Thai Beanie Babies. Uh, you've got Chinese takeaway menu on the wall here. So you can order your Chinese takeaway just here at dining for a great dine night in 
This one seems to have been closed down, unfortunately. But as we take a trip up the stairs here, you've got your guest services. Um, so if you do have any issues whilst you're on site, um, which is unlikely, you can go in there to guest services and get those resolved. And just the backside of the subtropical swim in paradise here, uh, you've got Starbucks in there as well. And coming round, we've got a leisure bowl, which will take you inside in just a second. And we've got Hux. So Hux is an American bar and grill. Yeah. yeah, so just give you an overview of the menu here in Hux. Uh, it's American bar and grill, so you've got a number of burgers, you've got nachos, you've got fajitas, you've got the steaks and things like that. We can share, we can share our chili, you've got bits on the side, you've got some chicken wings and uh, onion rings, all those kinds of things as well. And the way you order here is you scan the QR code because of all the current rules and regulations and things like that. Um, so you scan your QR code and that's how you order everything on the app. So we'll just give you kind of an overview of the app here. You can see how it works. Very much just website, add it to your browser, done. As it's all coming out, one for the burger. Oh, we've got a skillet of fajitas here. Set another way. Couple of burgers. New York strip steak looks incredible. Right, so let's take you in the leisure bowl. So let's come in. You've got a little arcade here. You've got a bar. Number of pool tables. Something else we got here down in the plaza is Park Market. Um, and this is their little supermarket where you can pick up all your little extra bits and pieces that you may want. So you've got a whole bunch of hot food, some amazing looking cakes as well. All your freshly baked goods. But then you've got all your supermarket bits and pieces that you may need anything you've forgotten to bring with you on your adventures. It's kind of set up like Ikea in here. So this is a really handy thing to have, especially when you've got a full kitchen. Uh, especially when you've got a full kitchen in your lodge. So another section here is the waterfront. So we've got the Action Challenge, we've got the Pancake House, the Boat House, Adventure Golf, which is just over there. And we'll come back to that in a second as well. Uh, the Waterfront Kiosk and Rangers Lodge. So also at the moment we have got, with it being Christmas, we've got some Christmas trails going on. So we're going to show you guys those now. So here on the lake, you can hire your canoes, your pedal boats, and all the little bits and pieces that you'd like to do out on the water. And these are all added extras, I believe. So you've got the boathouse. This is the duration that you purchased it for. Everything is all controlled via the app and via the website. Uh, you've got Pancake House as well. And then the Action Challenge, just over there in the back. So that's an adventure rope course. Uh, you've got zip lines and all sorts like that. Um, right up at the top there, you've got a couple of zip lines that go over there to the other side of the water. And cool thing about these boats is they're all electric as well, which is really neat. So you've got the action challenge, as we said. Um, so you see a few of the kind of like obstacle courses, the rope walks and things like that. Uh, at the moment, we've got Santa's Woodland Village as well. One of the really awesome things here that we've got for Christmas uh, is Santa's Woodland Village. And the decorations here look really cool. Like the snow that they've got going on, the lights, I can imagine this looks really, really awesome in the night. Just 
you've got these awesome decorations here. Uh, so here's your little guide to Santa's Woodland Trail. You've got the toadstool cabins, as you just saw. You've got a whole bunch of photo spots and little photo opportunities and things like that. They don't seem to have anything owl friendly for me, but it all sure looks tasty. Do you know what snowman eat for lunch? Is there a bird? Oh, we've got an elf. So this is quite cool, a uh, temporary exhibit for the holiday season. Winter Wonderland 2021. Really cool little trail here. Prancer. Hey Prancer. Deck the halls with boughs of holly. Ba la 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 la. Get two young and old pink and the bold thing on the down that is a small bit. Christmas is here today. Sleigh testing garage. New offer, only one glass of milk and two cookies for your sleigh testing. You've got Santa's workshop here where you can, I believe, go and meet Santa. Uh, we're not gonna meet him today because um, we're not young enough, but that's really cool. How do we measure up? As tall as a Christmas tree, as tall as a reindeer, as tall as a Christmas stack of presents, Christmas elf or as long as an elf. Ooh. I'm as tall as a reindeer. So Santa's workshop, you do also have to pre-book it. So just bear that in mind. You got a couple of little photo ops here as well. And one of the cool things about the photo ops, is you've got this little point here where you can pick your camera and take a selfie. Another, another awesome thing you've got here is miniature golf. It's a woodland themed miniature golf. Better view. Very cool area. Quite uh, easy holes, mostly. It's one of the really cool things that we do have here. Um, over by the venue, the plaza kind of area, uh, is this Escape the Forest. Um, little toy soldier. Uh, but this, what they're describing it as, is an outdoor escape room. Um, you can see you've got a pretty cool forest to escape from, that's for sure. Um, eight years plus, £27 per person. You book all this on your online ordering portal. Really cool extra activity that you can participate in. One thing you do have here at Centre Parks is a huge sort of outdoor activity centre where you can do um, sort of falconry, you can do archery, all that stuff. Um, at the moment, with it being particularly cold, we haven't gone up there. We haven't shown you guys that, unfortunately, but check it out online. There's loads of activities that you can participate in. Um, and definitely something we should recommend, especially in the summer months. So that's it for our little whistle stop tour here at Centre Parks Woburn Forest. Hopefully you've enjoyed having a look around and seeing kind of some of the activities that you can get yourself into and uh, some of the cool Christmas decorations that we've got going here in the holiday season. Really cool, they've really decked it out for the holidays. Um, you've got some awesome places to, to come and eat, um, do a bit of shopping, get a massage and things like that. Obviously, for obvious privacy reasons, I wasn't able to take you into the uh, spa, but trust us we just had a massage it is nice isn't it um so we do seriously recommend checking that out the pool area is absolutely fantastic and having that whole indoor um sort of water park complex is really cool so hopefully you did enjoy that um and if you did enjoy the video um give us a thumbs up i do appreciate it it really does help us out a lot it'd be great if you could hit that subscribe button and bell icon to be notified when we post all new videos we'll see you on the other side thanks